so <laughs> I can't do much anymore, right? Because it's I have little energy and whatever, but I've always been a grower. I was a very veg big vegetarian grower. We had crazy gardens. We grew everything. We grew it in Arizona under the scorching heat. We grew it in Oregon under the constant rain and cold. And we started growing here in Spain where we have lots of acres and that was part of my life. And then I became carnivore and I stopped growing stuff, which made me pretty sad. And also, like, I didn't know what to do. But then somehow I ended up finding cactuses and succulents and I'm like, that could be kind of a cool thing. So today we went out here. There's a guy that collects cactuses. He has a huge invernadero. What's it called? Greenhouse. Greenhouse. A huge cacti greenhouse and succulents. Like literally, it's ginormous. He has probably three now. And he's very passionate. And you can get the small cacti like these. Isn't it adorable? 10 for a euro, uh, 10 for 10 euros. So it's pretty cheap. And so we got a bunch. And because my mom passed and my mom had a lot of house stuff and silverware and this is called cutlery. No, this is this is dishes. Dishes? Flatware. You don't have a way to call all the dishes together? No, Sovilla? No. Yeah, I can't think of it right now. Okay, yeah. whatever. Anyhow, and some of those were from my grandma. We wouldn't use them because we have ours and there's only two of us, but we wanted to do something with it. And then guess what? We have the cacti. We have all these super cute mugs that are handmade, really old, they're over hundred years old now. And so we made this cup of cacti. <laughs> and I'll show you how I made the haul. And I'll show you the results here because right now it's just like this. But we're gonna plant them now if you wanna follow our crazy little adventure. It's really cool. Destroyed after the first time. 